Hey guys, it's Candice, Trinice, and Fee, and this is BGB. Today we back. You gonna say we back? We back. I was gonna say today. <laughs> <laughs> we super back. That's fine. I feel great. How y'all feel being back? Um, Clearly, I'm still getting cut off in this this world. Oh Sorry. my god! <laughs> oh, getting still getting. Things. You know you to cut her off her. Right. Chopping block. Well, you know. That's how things are sometimes. <laughs> but we're back, guys. We know you missed us. We missed you. We did. We absolutely did. And there's so many great shows that's out in spite of COVID. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. You know what, guys? Someone actually, um, they invited me to do something today. And I said, you know, I actually can't because I'm recording for the podcast today. And, well, that day, you know, which is today. <laughs> and um, they was like, oh, I'm so glad y'all coming back because what I need is a fall TV lineup show. So when y'all going to do it? And I was like, wow. I talk to the girls. I can't tell you. <laughs> Yo, we have some can pretty demanding that. fans. I will say that. Yeah. I've had people on my neck, like, do this, talk about this, when oh. y'all coming back. And I was oh. like, oh, wait a minute. <laughs> wait a minute. Like, we still got to oh, deal with man. life. We have a lot of changes this going on. This is what on. I'm saying. Like, like and know, sponsor us. Give us yeah. Give us the money. <laughs> 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 give <us> the money. <laughs> I mean, at least y'all can do is leave reviews. Like, do that. You know, put our name on out there. Yeah. Interact sure. with us on social media. Let right. Us know. That's that just coming up to us and just talking to us. We want other people to know that y'all talk to us. We want the people. So trail. they won't be like, oh, people they just making trail. it up. Like people be doing. <laughs> like, hey, put it, put put it, put something down there and say you, Stephanie. Or, oh yeah, we email each other. <laughs> that's what we should um, do. Go nah, on there. Email we don't each do other. that, time guys. For hey, Yola. Time for it. I had too much going on in my um, life. Uh, so we are going to start now. We have a lot to cover. Mm-hmm. and a little bit of time. Um, we're trying to do mm-hmm. much better with our time. Now, what we have decided for all of our lovely fans out there is we're going to give you what we can do in the time that we've allotted. And if you would like for us to continue the conversation, you'll let us know that you want us to do either another part or we can do a live and we all could just talk together. So, I'll say it again. This is going to be the version you get. Mm-hmm. If you want more, you have to request it. And mm-hmm. we have no problem with that. We ain't got no problem with that. Mm-hmm. There ain't no problem. There ain't no problem. There ain't no problem. <laughs> Um, but we're going to be talking about the shy season three. Yes. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to say this first and foremost. I was not a fan. Oh, my gosh. And I wasn't. I, I was. I wasn't a fan, but I I loved the season. I enjoyed it. Let's say that. Sounds like a fan to me. Definitely I mean, sounds like a fan. No, like, no, when I think of fan, I'm like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> Every fan is not a crazy I just, fan. I just said me. When I'm like a fan, I'm like, ah! What show like, do you do that that's for? That's not even. That's when you are a fan of a person, like no, a celebrity. No, I don't or care about like people. That. Oh. That's, it's people on these shows. <laughs> exactly. What? We're I don't care people. about people. I'm just people. saying. I don't. I'm not. Not, I don't fan out. I don't fan out them. on people like when they like if I see them. But when if I like a show, if you saw Jesus, you'd fan out. Jesus. <laughs> if you saw Beyonce, Beyonce, you was fan girl. You know, fan girl. I'm not going. I'm not. You're right. Because she's gonna piss me off. On this lovely, this lovely taping, and I don't have time Real for big. it. I don't have time for nah, it. We're gonna stay into it. Focused. <sighs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We say we're not doing it. We're not doing it. Focus. Ain't no problem. Ain't no problem. Um. So <laughs> you said you actually did love it. Love the show. Yeah, I I love this season because I like the stuff that they delve into. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, not both of us looking like that. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Okay. Candace. <laughs> um, season three was a bit of a roller coaster for me. Um, I didn't dislike this season, but I felt like they did drag some parts out. It was really, it was definitely dragging tails in there. And <laughs> it's almost time for dragging tails. It was almost like they just popped up and things were just so different. Girl. But. Well, we know. That's a girl that. of agreement. So, so y'all know. <laughs> It's historically a part of TV, though. Right. You know. Clearly. I just feel like. Chocolate on Kill them. Kill them. That is true. Like, funeral. Okay. All right. Well. That's how they did. Everybody don't get a funeral. People walk upstairs <laughs> and never come back. I mean, it's just like. <laughs> it is some a part of things TV. happen. Um, I thought that we had grown past that. But Me too. I don't know. But I feel like they just kind of like made it work. And, um, you know, we'll get more into it. And, oh, my God. That ending. <laughs> sent me oh yeah like you sent somebody else 
Well, no, not like it's in somebody else's. Uh, let no, me just throw this up right now. Spoiler alert, because y'all know. But the season is over, so you should have watched it. Mm-hmm. But this is your moment to pause for the cause. I'm trying to tell y'all. And then not let it be spoiled. Because you know that they're going to spoil it. They that was spoil it. it. You know, they going to spoil it. You going to spoil it, too. <sighs> I'm not a spoiler. Definitely. Definitely. Spoiled yeah. milk. <laughs> Um, but no, on that same vein, that I feel like not even for real. <laughs> <laughs> That's even worse. I feel like with that, I understand like they have to make. <laughs> there it is, like, guys. That's, That's the a real, real one. one. <laughs> um, they have to make changes in shows. I understand that, but I think it's the way that they did it. It was too many at once for me. Like, let's I, take your some your. Things were out of I do understand that. Control, I get though. it, but I'm saying like that's what affected. They had storylines just up in the air. First of all, <laughs> y'all know we watched Miss Ethel get that beat down. I was traumatized by Miss Ethel getting that beat down. We didn't find out about her until like five episodes in. Yeah. Okay. Because they knew what was going to happen with Miss like, Ethel. They should have said. They should have mentioned something. <laughs> I was so, I was all worried. Like, they when we come back, like... we're going to come back to um, Miss Ethel in the hospital and she going to be on life support. No, Something's they season. came back with her, with what? her like losing, um, her memory a little bit. That's how they came back. But she her? didn't come. Like at the beginning, we didn't hear none of that. Okay. We had a wedding, a funeral. She um, is not the m- most supported cast end. member. <laughs> she is very important. She was important because uh, you know how I feel about Grandma Miles. But <laughs> not uh, Grandma Miles. <laughs> but um, you know. But yeah, and I mean, I get it. You know, Jason Mitchell was unfortunately let go from the show, um, due to his tragic, honey. Due to some things that happened that. We don't know the facts about, so we won't talk about it. Yes. Uh, but it's unsavory <laughs> behavior, nonetheless, whatever it was. Those fingers um, met, allegedly. <laughs> <laughs> also, um, I want to say, what's his name? Bart? I want to say his real name is Bart. But Reg is. is gone. It's so crazy. I've never met a real black person named Bart. I don't know if it's just Bart or if it's Barton. Barton? I thought it say Bartholomew. is Barton. Because Bartholomew is Barton. long for Bart. Fitzpatrick. Barton. Oh, thank you. Um, so, yeah, Barton's gone. That was just, uh, you know, I know that this is the life takes life, but they could have done better. Virgin didn't even get a funeral. Okay. He it's, definitely you, didn't. And who was going to give him the funeral, Jake? Yeah. But I'm just saying, girl, I mean, old boy got more respect Street? than Reg. Who? Brandon. Because he had Brandon. a family. <laughs> Barely. He had That's a about, mom. How y'all feel about his mother's uh See, this, this is eulogy. what You know what? This is, a side, this is a side thing. This is prime example why people say them streets won't take care of you. Mm. Because, why they say it? Because they don't. Because they don't. Because they don't. <laughs> they were not there. It is evident in this storyline. I mean, no one did. No one said are anything. You right now? In this storyline. <laughs> <laughs> a grandmama. She turned it. No, I was going to say that. <laughs> um... But no, I just I feel like that funeral was a lot for me. First of all, the fact that Kevin is running back and forth and pause right there because all of the boys are grown now. They are grown. Like they're so grown. big. If you look at them in season one, and now I'm just like, oh Jake my God. Lips still need some ah, or something. Some TLC. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that they dry though. I just think that they are discolored. See, I didn't oh. say that's why I said TLC. Whatever it is, I yeah. hope. I hope but it's I don't know. That what it would is. be cosmetic surgery. If it's he got money now. He got money now. Girl, uh, please. Sometimes, he got the bag. sometimes that that don't even. Dude, I can't get rid of him. And, and I he still can. love Papa. Like, I oh, still Papa. Papa. Um, I saw Papa on something else the other day. Oh, what? I thought she was about what to say else? It wasn't like, another show. I it was. <laughs> I didn't know that. Um, the well, Tim's Tia and Tamara. Them. Tim, Tia, and Tamara. No, not Tim. <laughs> oh. I said Tia and Tamara. Them. They um. I was watching one of them. I'm not sure which one I was well, watching. What was it? What were they doing? They were going. Oh, her husband is. The, Go ahead. Is, is he it. black or is he white? Black. Okay. So it's Tia. Okay. So I saw her. She. They were going on. First of all, she thinks Tia is hideous, guys. Just I so do not. Clear. I do she says not. All the time. She hates Tia. I Maui. do not see. I people, love you, Tia. People she <laughs> just won't let stuff go. Like I have grown for me to, to let it go. I mean, it had to be there. So Whatever. She's so let's my point. Anyway, it's just strange because they are I twins. I know. Makes anyway, no they were going on vacation to meet her husband's um family or whatever, and, and Papa they, was there. And Papa was there, what? and they were like they family. Yeah, he, he's the, he's um the cousin, a cousin on the father's side. I mean, on her husband's side. I think so. Yeah. Wow. Wow. I was like, oh, that's so cool. Like that is cool. Hmm. Interesting. You just never know. I mean, celebrities do be celebrities. Hey, because you know Yara Shahidi and Nas are cousins. Huh? Yeah. 
Wow. Mm -hmm. That's what I say when I feel like that. It's a lot of good cousins. It's a lot of cousins. And these real cousins. It's a, this a melting pot. <laughs> That's not even the, the play cousins. These are real cousins. <laughs> People, um, you know, for a long time, I didn't know Lisa and and Dubrick was sisters, but girl, oh, for a long time, time. Until pause, I, pause, because did y'all see how she was? They was her beefing. Out? Yeah, I ain't watch her video. Yeah, I didn't watch the video. Lisa Ray be going off. They always First beefing all, why though, you just and then they her make Lisa? up. Got me confused. I'm like Lisa Landry. <laughs> Lisa Ray. Yeah, where's white I Lisa? Call her Lisa. Uh, oh. <laughs> I don't know Lisa. Lisa. She gonna be wilding us out next. She used to be a um like a queen or a princess or something. Yeah, of Turks and Caicos. Yep. Until that fell apart. Ooh, and honey. now she hates Dwayne Martin, honey. We're not oh, getting into this. We're not getting oh. into that. And she then, hates isn't guys. Um, Nia and um, Samo sisters? Yeah, Nia, Nia Long and Samo sisters. Yeah. yeah, you just never know, man. Just, well, a lot of them don't want to be attached. <laughs> they, don't wanna be they don't want to be Beyonce be. sister. Right. Yeah. Or uh, Brandy's it. brother. <laughs> I get it. I get it. Sometimes I just uh, don't want to be Dirk's wife, you know? I can't wow, tell. That's a... Right. <laughs> like, oh my God, I love my baby. I'm Mrs. Burton. What's the password? Mrs. Burton sits forever, forever and ever. ever. <laughs> Mrs. Burton five ever. <laughs> Whatever. I mean, you had the choice. Anyway, anyway, sorry back guys. To, back to the show because here we go with a derailment. This is what y'all love. This is what y'all love. This is what y'all love. For. So. Once Brandon was gone, because he was like our main, mm -hmm. male and we had character. so much hope for him. I really did. You, you, I you, you know stand. what? You, uh, she had so much hope for that character. I cannot stand when real life <laughs> situations affect, affect the show. Yeah, because like yeah. on the on the flip side, you know, it's a lot of actors that hate when you call them mm -hmm. their name. Yeah. So like um, yeah. Jamal from On My Block, uh -huh. he was like every time he put something up, they'd be like. Oh, God, don't do that, Jamal. <laughs> it's like put the face up like they call my name him is Jamal Brent. or Hummel. Uh, Hummel. Either one. That's what I'd have <laughs> and been I was like, it's crazy because as much as this is a role, it affects <laughs> their life forever. Right, right. And it also affects our life. Because yeah. now, because Jason Mitchell didn't know what to do. His name Jason, yeah. Jason Mitchell didn't know what to do. We don't have a Brandon anymore. Right. And that changed the he whole dynamic of the show. On. Huh? He knew he was his name. <laughs> yeah, I mean, but and then the job. crazy thing is, shows these days, you live on after you die. Not true. I know. That is true. You can I be know. a ghost. You know it's very lucrative That's, to be deceased. It, it is. It is. Sometimes more. Sometimes, <laughs> sometimes more. more. Yeah, because sometimes you be seeing that character a whole lot more. And you be like, what? Like, wow. I thought <laughs> that she was true. dead. That's Jack. True. It's Jack. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. yes. You yes. Prime example. More, more dead, dead than alive. <laughs> wow. That is very true, guys. Oh. But anyway, so... How do we feel about Emmett now being the lead male Brandon. role? Em Emmett's Brandon now? Yes. Yeah, yeah. How you feel I about hope it? not, Emmett. Please. Well, he got a girlfriend slash Beyonce slash wife or something. I don't know, but he really loves her. So hopefully he, he really do. loves her, but he cheated he? on her. Exactly. Every I'm chance talking he get. about in okay, real not every chance life. <laughs> oh, in real life. I'm what, just saying he's it? with some, I don't know who the who the young lady is, but he's like really in love with her. I think so. it's old girl from um Empire. Hmm. What is her name? Is Soraya. I and I love that one song on Empire. Look, but don't touch. That is my joke. Uh -uh. See, I don't know. I, I like his character. I, I really know. like him. Um, I wasn't you really sure. like him? He's such she really a loves dog. The show. She really loves he the is show. A dog. Right, because she's not a fan. <laughs> I'm not fan. I just like said. the way I'm not, but I just like the way that they are allowing his character to progress. Mm -hmm. uh, I can, I can, you know, I, I, I like it because it honestly Take your time, you got does it. remind me a little of you know how Brandon kind of started out, you know, real. But he wasn't a cheater though. No, he wasn't. He, he wasn't was a cheater. into his career. He was about well. Emmett dance. is more along the lines of the characters of people we know now. Wow. So what people? Well, we not know. people we know. Ooh, I don't but, know for sure. So nobody. I don't know. So, oh, here's my question. Oh, yikes! We're not about to do that. <laughs> We're not about to do that. Here's my question. Here's my question. <laughs> Let's do no, it. No, 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 no. no. Here's my no, question for some people. Are happy with Barry now? Ooh. 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 Oh well, yeah. I don't know nobody <laughs> she's talking about. I thought she was trying to say something to me. She ain't got. I ain't got nothing to do with nothing like that. So anyway, here's my question for Ooh, our viewers my God. and for y'all do you think male infidelity is unavoidable hmm. Hmm. no i don't now I don't. i'm saying this you, i'm sorry i'm saying it because remember when they went to see the the lady the that's lady, what i was going on and of, she yeah. drew the cards first of all i want to tell everybody that's on instagram you know it was real cute when give me morgan was the one reading y'all little horoscopes <laughs> now y'all got them tarot cards y'all better watch it yeah i don't play with better watch i don't it. play with that anyway so i was talking to trey about that early he was dying laughing but anyway so you know she want to be one brother. girl don't you <laughs> so i just feel like they sat at the table and in exchange for a reading what's her name tiffany 
Uh, the girlfriend, I think so. Yes. Tiff. Tiff, Tiff. yes. Oh, yep. So Tiff was like, I'm in exchange for your reading, I'll give you medicinal weed because the lady's like, she has cancer uh-huh. or whatever. And the lady was like, okay, I'm going to read the cards. And Emmett just wanted to be with her at work that day. That mm-hmm. wasn't good business for me. What? And he said the same thing. He was like, this ain't this ain't going to keep happening. Yeah, that's not, it's not good business. <laughs> um, especially if that service is not providing anything. But she like, felt, but she felt anymore. like it was providing I mean, yeah, her something. I don't she care. Did. That she really <laughs> wanted to know. She really I wanted to care. know. So they sat down and she read the cards and basically was like, He's gonna cheat on you. Yeah, like he wants more than one. Mm. His more penis needs more than one. Oh, <laughs> I said penis. Like uh. <laughs> he's gonna be in and out, terms. girl, in and out. Literally. That's usually how it goes. I mean, <laughs> of many, <laughs> and out. Now so that is not how they left. Go. They left, and Tiff was real upset. It was uh-huh. calling him out, and he was just like, "How you gonna believe her? This didn't even happen. Mm-hmm. I'm in trouble for something that didn't even happen." And lo and behold, it happened. It didn't went happen. That With la 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 no, I'm just saying she don't have two lines. Sound like I hate it just now. She doesn't have many lines. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. How she good? She only had two lines. She's not good. <laughs> she became a supporting Girl, actress. I, I mean, saw a meme like the other day. This. I like her in this. I like the fact that she's cooking and all that other stuff. The oh. other day, and it had you know of how when Tasha killed um when Tasha killed her, and it was like Tasha told the gun and she about to shoot. What's her name? In that Keisha. And it's Keisha. like God and my blessings. And I said, Why would they use that picture? Oh my God! I did laugh, but y'all know I got a sixth sense of humor. So they pe- y'all be going so far, so far. You go um, really far yourself. Ah, I, I do not. So, how do y'all feel about their relationship journey? Like we got to the point where Emmett and Tiff have been through a lot. Like they left where they were, moved mm-hmm. back in with. Jada, Emmett's mother. Mm-hmm. Um, I thought she was pregnant, but uh, who Tiff? Yeah, she was pregnant. What happened? I think she they had lost a... the baby, and they talked about it. Oh, God, talked about it. Is that because lost the baby. Is she, she lost the baby? To Keisha about it. I was going to say I Keisha. thought she. Oh, yeah, I didn't think she lost the baby. I thought she. I thought she had, yeah. <sighs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. <laughs> okay. Because we get on her nerves. I know. Okay. I'm just saying. But yeah, she just knew that she wasn't ready because she wasn't even sure where they were going to go at, you know. So she she just said no. I just can't do it. She should have. No. I no. Guess she shouldn't have said no. I mean, what? it is her man. Uh, so y'all here for them? <laughs> like now that he's on the straight and narrow or trying? I just I'm don't know if. The way they doing it. I was just saying, I don't know if it's going to work. I know mm-hmm. this. I feel like this. I feel like. He wants it to. I feel like that he's trying to put forth the effort, but I also feel like he doesn't have the restraint mm. to to not do it. You know what I'm saying? It's like it's like clearly he's definitely his father's child. Oof. And his he father's an nerves. idiot. He idiot. is idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Heavy on ideas. <laughs> um but yeah, his father's really stupid. He gives some horrible advice. He's mm-hmm. too old. Mm-hmm. Yes. yes. And he but still big, wears a blue tooth. Like, is that even a, that is a drive through. I be hating um, when I see set. people driving with that. Girl. I be like, they play Xbox? Or That's something? what I used to use in my old job. For work. Xbox. <laughs> they have better stuff than that on the Xbox. <laughs> they even. sure do. But I think that the way that he's doing things is psychotic. Mm. And it is, it's no like strategy behind it. And sometimes you, you know, sometimes you do do stuff in life, and it's just like, all right, this is it. I'm jumping on it. But he does that too often. Mm-hmm. And for him to have no plan, oftentimes behind certain things, knowing that, like you said, it's really hard for him to stay on the straight and narrow. It's just like, should I even do this? Because like you're gonna do something. I don't know if we said, but he proposed to her. Um, mm-hmm. You're going to do something as, you know, gives a, such a big um, gesture. gesture. And, nigga, you just was sleeping with somebody a couple days ago. Yeah. I but, mean, blessing her back wide and, but, and the thing about open. it is, in his mind, he's like, she don't mean nothing. Yeah, and an but establishment. But this is mind, the thing, though. And it's crazy, but in his mind, she ain't nothing to him. Like, that's, you know what? And that's fine. She can mean nothing all day long, but they business partners. Uh-huh. Diamond. And uh-huh. he risked 
losing business if somebody would have walked in on him. Because first of all, true. that's not sanitary. <laughs> Let's check serve safe. It's not sanitary. <laughs> Second of all, if that was the number that I was on, it's trifling. And y'all could really just get locked up for indecent exposure. <laughs> because y'all was really, they just That's was true. taking their clothes and off. And thirdly, y'all got, the person, in. y'all got the person that y'all trying to convince here. Like, you right. could have waited, waited right. until this, like, the event not even, it's practically still happening. He right. could have went to have rest the house. <laughs> he mm. sure could have. Rest the house. And and rest I the just house, don't, I, what, I, I feel like I'm not even falling for this, this role that she playing. the house to run. Mm, like because i think that a lot of times and good intentions Mm -hmm. oh not i really can't even see good intentions but the intentions of a woman trying to be like a dude does not always pan out the correct way it depends on the woman Uh, i just don't see it i just don't see it i see like i could tell right (laughs) away that she was sort of kind of catching feelings when she saw him um with to propose to her Mm. like nigga you just was with me and then she tried to play it off like what you thought that meant something to me but it did but, but it did didn't jada she asked oh she, she picked right up on it yeah. like a mother no not even just a mother but a woman for real for real knows and i know that tiff gonna pick up on it too because she she because the fact that she is being more um taking more part in the this business yeah. mm-hmm. now than what she was before because before it was just like she was doing her thing he was doing yeah. his thing but because she trying to bond them together more and do more stuff <clears throat> She definitely gonna pick up on it, and then they because they gonna to slip each up. Other. That's what I'm saying. I was like, she she Angel gonna read it. Rush. That's and that's what I mean about disrespect. Like that's Ooh. what you know. What <laughs> I've never been the type of female who does stuff to like a guy's property or even like mm. you know fight a guy. No, Jason like Sullivan. That. Mm. Exactly. I don't have time for it. I'm not paying for nothing. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm not going to jail for none of that. If we actually fight, then we are gonna actually be fighting. And I'm <laughs> I'm not gonna be upset if you hit me back because I hit you and it's just gonna be bad. I get it. I understand. So that's why I just don't do certain things. But that type of disrespect is the type of disrespect that'll put you in a position to be that crazy person. Oh, yeah, definitely. And niggas wonder why, like, oh, you so crazy. Why are you <laughs> acting like this? I am crazy. You're oh, right. You made me. You <laughs> drove me crazy. And Child, I think it's right a, down the street. A lot of people that love to do things and then cry at the consequences. Right. Like, like right. he lo- he's sitting here and you telling this woman to trust you, uh-huh. to build with you, to do all of Tiff, this. Please. Yeah, Tiff. like you trying to convince her. Trust me. To, yeah, like trust that I'm, I got our best interests. Right. And you only serving yourself. Like, right. And I think that's what it is because honestly, and I, I feel this way about a lot of people. If you are honest, and I'm going to say with a woman because, you know, we heterosexuals here. But if you're honest with the, if you a male and you're honest with your woman, you give her the choice to say, like, okay, you right. cheated. Right. Do I want to work through this or not? Now right. what he's doing is playing on her face because when she finds out. <sighs> because that, he had already cheated on her so many times and she's accepted him back. Yeah, face. like, and that's she's accepted him back. So now this and is. And honestly, this is Lala, you might want to watch your back. Because <laughs> because be now little... because the difference now is that not only is he doing it, but now you disrespecting her too right. because you key key keying in her yeah. face. So you now know the I'm business saying? the business is doomed in her eyes. She's not going to yeah. respect the business. Oh because heck, because y'all no. built that. Sonny, get it back. <laughs> Oh, old. But okay, <laughs> that's enough for Eminem. Tiff. Okay. We have to move on. All right. Um. So we're gonna go on to the biggest. I think the biggest storyline this season was Keisha. Mm-hmm. Um. And we come to find out that Keisha has gone missing, mm-hmm. and she was missing for a very forever. Yeah, she, she was, was missing for like that was the storyline. Only she was... ten. <laughs> it's yeah. only ten episodes. She was she missing, was missing so much. for like four. It was a lot. It, it was, was. It was a lot. lot. It was a lot. They um, didn't find her until like two episodes. But they were trying. I think. I feel like they were trying to really make it um oh, i get it realistic you know i get it <laughs> but it was a lot yeah it and was. I, and then too i think also they've probably felt like let's go ahead and just drag this out because they still trying to find their footing because of you know mm-hmm. how they had to hurry up and kind of put a show together yeah. unexpectedly so they figure this is a good storyline let's stick with this for a while and, yeah, and, and, also, and throw in a couple little things and we'll be alright yeah also it might be because they're trying to let us know the severity of this this crisis is definitely that yeah, that's in, what they you know, to make that's us what, aware yeah. and that's mm-hmm. how I felt that's why honestly I, I like the storyline um, when I, as soon as I saw her on that bus stop I called it I called it Y'all just, <laughs> y'all probably need to just start calling me and finding out. Because like, I know. Me what's going Cause I know. Because I know. So I was like, uh, I know what this storyline going to be. But y'all, if and y'all didn't watch this storyline, yeah. It's y'all need just to watch wild it. to I me. like that she was able to get um, But I, I really, 
<laughs> it's it's right. That's it. That's it. Right. That's it. Whatever. Um, I just feel like <laughs> that's it. I be She's lo- gone. Cause no, I like when I be messing up words. So yeah, cause I, you like it. Cause I just love to see y'all face. They be like, <laughs> they be trying. Now that y'all can see us, <laughs> sometimes I be wishing that y'all could like zoom in because their face was like. <laughs> <laughs> You know, half the time is me just trying to process. Like, my father speaks another language anyway, so if he not cursing, I'm not I barely trying know to process saying. it because I don't want it to get stuck inside of me. And I'll be like, "What? What are you?" Oh yeah, trying? I was saying this word wrong one day, and I, that confused us so much. She just started saying it wrong. But <laughs> this storyline, I just felt like, you know, I do think it's necessary. Mm-hmm. I do think it was very long, um, but it really made me check myself because I know. That was me, plenty of years. Right, like, right. Like you travel, kidnapped. I was going to no, know. but travel alone. Like, oh my I god, never, this is not yeah. the time for I've, me to find out about that. I've, uh, well, we're not gonna talk about that. But, uh, come on, um, I've, after show, yeah, no. after show, the after show. I always show was, was just like, show. I got it. Like I'm good. Uh-huh. Don't worry. Mm-hmm. Yeah, None for of that. sure. Me too. Because it's so, like, yeah, what like y'all, are y'all driving me somewhere? Exactly. Like that's the thing. No, people. And then they get mad when you tell them, call me, text me, let me know. That's false. We not gonna. We not gonna get in that that because the last time that I was gone for some time Ooh. and I was trying to call you and text you, <laughs> you didn't have no rent for me and you wasn't Dang. even returning my calls. Ain't no you rent. was treating me just like you was my nigga. Oh, wow. She's lying. She feels away. Not lying. Oh, I wow. got receipts. Ooh. Let me explain After something show. to you After show. Um, so, <laughs> no need. With, with that, like, I just remember, like, me being on a bus, mm-hmm. it being late. Because, I mean, at one point, we both worked the evening shift. We used to get off, like, around midnight. Uh-huh. And it wasn't until we started working like mm. close together that I would be riding with her or whatever. But right. until then, like I was catching the bus home, had my headphones in, like just like Keisha was. Right. So it's just like it's crazy to me. Y'all that- let me tell you about that real quick. So we used to work it's a it's no an way. pace. We used to work at Hopkins. Don't it's an no pace. <laughs> no. And it is an pace. Okay. We'll never All be right. back there again. All right. Lord willing. <laughs> Unless I in a anyway. supervisor position. <laughs> Maybe I don't know. It, anyway, so <laughs> At first, I was working day shift. Then I got on evening shift, and we used to have lunch together, have an enjoyable we did, time. We did. Uh, Trinice used to talk to all these niggas. That used oh to come my to the god, she, she is so lying, popular. y'all. She, she is like, lying. Oh hey, what's up? Mm-hmm. Wow, right? she's lying. And so I was like, oof, I need to start making sure that this girl get home safe because she just trashy, right? So <laughs> I didn't get a call until probably like a year or two into working at Hopkins. And so I used to drive our grandma's car, right? And so <laughs> she used to be like, I got off at 11.30. I thought, I, I guess she was my woman. She was checking for me. <laughs> like, I know it only take 3.3 <laughs> seconds for you to get home. Why are you not here yet? Please. And I used to be like, oh, sorry. She used to specifically say, you out gallivanting these streets <laughs> in my car. And I'd be like, grandma, I'm taking your granddaughter home because she got to get on the bus. Oh, Shanice. <laughs> <laughs> and so for a long time her name was Shanice. Yeah. I've had a lot of gone through a lot of name changes, guys. But um yeah. Because it's color, dangerous out here. That call was very something. Dangerous. That call broke my nose. We're gonna get into it that did another not time. Break your nose. But yeah, like it just really made me sit and think. First of all, count my blessings because it could have happened and it didn't, thank mm-hmm. God. But at sure. the same time, it's so much to be like you just oblivious to the fact that it can be you. Mm-hmm. And that's the thing I feel like mm-hmm. a lot of the youth now and even the, we just take for granted things that could happen. Right. You really never know. One minor difference, one change can literally just uh, affect your entire life. And like I mean, she, she just was, oh, well, she was lying because she lied and was and like, she was always sneaking out. And she made and the thing, Kevin lie. I was going to say that Kevin that's lie. the thing about it. The other thing is that she was always sneaking out and stuff. So he didn't even know to was like so, yeah. tell sooner than what he did because he was covering for her, basically. Yeah. So, <clears throat> so y'all stop lying. <laughs> I ain't never had to lie because you know it was just you like grown. you thought she was grown. It wasn't Ooh. that I was Y'all grown. My grandmother was raising me, and <laughs> she just like, "Oh, you come home, and if it's Saturday and Sunday, everybody in this house go to church." So, <laughs> <you> know, <laughs> right? I mean, she was say, and this was back when I was catching the bus and not driving. When I started driving her car, then mm. you all know what happened. <laughs> <laughs> um, she was out here gallivanting in the streets. Girl, I wasn't even. Okay, okay. okay. That's that's the crazy thing about it's not real. Go ahead, sis. But. <laughs> When I was actually, I remember, um, I used to be real cool with this girl named Ashley Wright, and so we used to catch the forty four all the time. But I lived, I lived over east most of my life 
things have changed. But <laughs> I lived over east most of my life, and I used, but I used to always be over west with her. So we would catch the forty four from like out, like my side of town, over to her side of town. So one time we was waiting on the forty four, right by Good Samaritan, and. It was dumb late. Like, I want to say it was probably like 12, 1, something in the morning, right? And so this guy rolled past. He was like, what y'all doing out here on this bus stop? Uh-uh. And so he was like, we're waiting for the bus to go home. He was like, oh, y'all going to be waiting forever. The next bus don't come till like 4 o'clock. <laughs> 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 now, granted, he was wrong. The bus did come like 45 minutes later. But still, like I said, it was already past midnight. Right. We were on the bus. And I mean, yeah, at that point, I was, you know, with my own girl. Had a but... schedule. But that's the thing. Like, it's so many things I know out. me personally I was doing. And you lose, like, you lose track of time. And it affects everything else. Like, literally, if I would have called and said, if you would have called and said, I'm waiting for the bus and it's not going to be for 45 minutes. You're lying. Exactly. Where you at? Who you with? Why? Like, honestly, like you knew what time, time you were supposed to be in. Thanks, But friend. it was no time that I was supposed to be anyway. Yeah. Like, the thing, I was going from over east to over west to her house. <laughs> and I probably was still coming back home after that. So it was just like, I was just out now. I didn't ever have to sneak out the house, but I did have to sneak in the house because sometimes <laughs> I would forget my keys and I would climb through the front window. Oh my and God, it's a burglar. <laughs> my grandma used to be so pissed. How my pissed grandma. was she? She yeah. was so pissed that she said, if you climb through this window again, I'm putting you out of this house. <laughs> Well, well, you look real sketchy. You may be glad nobody called the cops. That's me, what girl. she was saying. And then you teaching people how to break into the house. Oh, what if they think exactly. that you a robber? You know, what else, you know what else on that same vein? Why do black mothers, you can answer. Why do black mothers feel like if you lose their key, everybody can come to their house? Anybody can come to the how house. They know? How they because know? Because most of only Hillary Banks <laughs> put her address <laughs> on the keys. Like, I mean, so I was so y'all, mad at my mother thing. about that. This is the thing. Y'all never know who watching y'all. That's number one. Even now to this day, guys. I still won't drive home the same way all the time. That's because strange because the market around the corner, how many different ways can you get it's from here today? It's probably because she don't remember. It's Dang, a couple of different right. ways. I go a the, couple. The, well, they about go to know the now. Way. Go ahead and tell them. Go ahead and tell them. No, no. That's why I stopped. <laughs> I, I go, go a different way. <laughs> I go, I and go I don't different. know how y'all get so mad. Y'all do stuff and it just be done. Didn't you lose your keys in the market before? Oh, we. Yes, you did. Y'all yes, shoot your like you car keys. Car keys. on the side of house keys. Car keys. Where your house key at? They were on two separate chains. Thank you very much. What around I said was, the corner? What I said was, the first of all, around the corner? First yes. of all, how you don't get gas and you on the side you of the road? Together. <laughs> how you do that? How you do well, that? Well, first of all, yeah, when exactly. your gas tank thing don't work, sometimes you just forget. How no, you, you one of those, I know my car. I know my car. I do know my car. People. <laughs> you, you clearly ain't know it that day. Wow. <laughs> they just anyhow, a bunch well, of double anyhow, standards. Anyhow. Say a bunch of double standards. The only thing. Don't call them parents. Call them double standards. Whatever. The only thing that sometimes y'all need to realize is that, like, when you on these bus stops, kiddos, kiddos, <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, like, I always tell even DeMarco, like, when he's walking down the street or whatever, because this 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 sex trafficking thing, y'all, cannot just happen to girls, but it can happen to boys also. It is. So um, I always tell him if he has, has his headphones on, keep one on, keep one off, you know, kind of keep. Looking around because you just he never know. Girl, he got you know anime rap. He got Walkman. He did. <laughs> so, <laughs> first of all, he probably he record- was, when he first got the headphones, he was only wearing them just to look cool. It was nothing being played on them because oh, they weren't even thing. plugged in. To oh anything. my god! I know <laughs> he wasn't wearing no, that one pair of ear, the, um, headphones. That the, the big the head- ones. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but no, like that's that's real. So like what I was taught, like you hold your keys. Like between right, your hands. Between your, so that so, if you got to jab somebody in the right. eye, you do that. That's right. I used to always, like if somebody, and even now, if I'm walking somewhere and you I know somebody the behind the me, I make sure I look back and I see them. Right. So that if something happens, I know what they look like. I can describe what they was wearing, stuff like that. And if if somebody's with me, like, so yesterday, with me. <laughs> yesterday I went to Sam's Club and then I went to a market and it was mm-hmm. very different distances. And I saw this woman and her son in both places and I was like, if she following me, we should <laughs> fight. Stop following me, B. <laughs> Shout out to Cletus. Yo, I was like, I said, Trey, didn't we see her at the last door? And she was like, yeah, I think so. I said, let her come down this aisle if she see, wants. That's, see, when I'll, people are with me and they be like, I think so, I be like, oh, see, you ain't the one. See, because see, I need people know, around yeah. me that keep but no, And then, like, you really got to be attentive. Because, like, with crazy people on the bus stop, yeah. I, used like, I used to be like, hey, friend, how you doing? Because when you blow this bus up, remember, we friends. <laughs> and just let me out the back door. And honestly, like. This one time, this man was going wild and crazy. I just had to get louder than him. And yeah. then we was fine. Yeah. We was fine. Yeah. But it's it's a lot 
of risks that come with having to do that. And I feel like many parents don't really want exactly. to have their children on like public transportation during yeah. these times and Especially everything. Especially not now. But you don't have the means or like if you're a person that doesn't have a car, like it's not really a choice. Right. So you just open to any element because you never know what can happen on public transportation. And you never that, know. It's just like school schedules are so stupid. Yeah. Like if I ever had to take care of any of my kids, like it would be like, Either I can pick him up or I can take him. I can't do both. <laughs> like, why is, is it true. like this? I feel like it wasn't like that for us. But, hmm. girl, ain't nobody oh. pick me up and take me Girl, anywhere. you're telling me? Always I used to walk, I used to walk an extra Candace bus stop. Candace Ledge Cleek. Oh, my God. But Ledge anyway, y'all, we got to really take this seriously. We do, we do. Um, I know that we're having a good time with it or whatever. <laughs> we're not having a good time with it. We're just telling you guys. I'm just talking about without stories and things like that. Yeah. But, but yeah. But it's, it's There's so much serious. more to this whole situation, it is though. so yeah. much. So another thing I did want to bring up is, like, when she went missing, the first thing a lot of people tried to do was, like, demonize her because of her social media. Yeah, that's, that's what they said. always do. And I feel like the thing that really gets me is people project what they want uh-huh. on social media. They uh-huh. show you what they want to show you on their Insta and their Finsta. On their Twitter and their Twitter, as we've called it, and um, you, I really feel like you cannot define a person about it. And just because somebody is looking like a thigh on, online does not mean they don't deserve to be found right, or they don't deserve justice. And it makes me so upset that like that's literally respectability and what was politics. And it's crazy. I mean, what was even worse for me is that they were black women. Yeah, like, like tear her down. And I'm just like, everybody at any point has been in a situation that probably looked bad. But right. you know yourself and you know that that's not you. And like don't be uppity because y'all kids be having fences too. They sure do. <laughs> People just don't tell you because they don't want to hurt your little feelings. Mm-hmm. Right. But, but girl, yeah, like that really. Girl, ain't that Lou daughter? And girl, think, I'm not telling her because you know she ain't going to hear me. Lou Vern. Oh, my God. Lou Vern. And then <laughs> the other part that we got to keep in mind is just um, the after effects of it. You know, mm-hmm. like once they are, because, okay, trauma. guys. They were. She was found. Um, okay. <laughs> Here you go. I don't spoil anything. I don't spoil anything. <laughs> she was found, uh, which was such a good thing for me because I was like, like you said, it was like a couple of stories, and I was just like, oh god, I just hope that they find her. You know what I'm saying? Like, I need them to know. So, um, I was I like, need them to know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but you know, because she went through. First of all, dude was absolutely crazy, and the crazy, the other crazy part was she was in the neighborhood, he was her and that's hair the other up. thing. I know. The neighbor, na- and that's the other thing. Like they can be right in your neighborhood, and you not even know. That's, that's how true. it always that is. is true. And I mean, he, he looked very normal. Mm-hmm. He was looking a little weird. To he me. was yeah, looking he a little weird to me. Um, but me. I'm just saying. But you know, pretty normal. You know, people talk to him or whatever. I mean, some of his neighbors knew him, but they clearly the didn't neighbors, know him. The neighbor lady said that he was crazy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> people, people be knowing when Ronnie was right. his name Ronald. Yeah, I don't know. just call him Ronnie. Ronnie. And stop it. Ron- <laughs> What's the say, Ronald? <laughs> um, yeah, like it just was crazy to me, like to find out because I just didn't know who it was. It was so much that we was like, who could it possibly be? Uh-huh. Because I think right across the street from that bus stop was like the... Ronnie was was walking past. And we was all oh, like, so everybody was like, oh my God. Ronnie. Yeah. That because is what was I said. Like, it couldn't be him. Yeah, because gonna it was he just, only got a home. Exactly. And it was just too, it was too, Killer? too easy. But then, it, you know, they started leading us to his surroundings, which was because he lived with, you know, homeless people pretty much under the bridge. He was Scared feeling comfortable row. there. He didn't even have to still live there anymore. Yeah. But he felt comfortable, he said. So, um, but it could have been them because a lot of things happened there yeah. and because and, that's like their own community so they're not going to share if you and they was not community. playing when Dre tried to come up there yeah. they they like, get, her out, get her, her out of here <laughs> out. like it, it was just like the Keisha? thing Keisha <laughs> do it again do it again Keisha <laughs> <laughs> the thing that really got me is we couldn't you don't know who to trust like in those uh-huh. moments it's like okay yeah we know Ronnie and we know he got a trouble we place. know Ronnie I was going to say because we do know Ronnie, be, yeah, Ronnie like, it, it could be it could be <laughs> it couldn't be it could be this it couldn't be like it was just so much uncertainty mm-hmm. and then it happened like right after um their mother and Dre got married right um, somebody, I did not like Dre this season somebody was trying to say that um Dre had something to do with it. I was like, who said it? Why would she do that? This idiot I knew. Why would they say that? This idiot I knew. Because they will lose her. Um, <laughs> but yeah, like, I just felt like, and an- another thing with that too, I don't know how it works, but to have a person that's not blood try to go as hard mm-hmm. for yeah. the-, the person, because I know it was a lot of times that their mother and Dre bumped heads right. about how to approach it, what to do, things like that. Mm-hmm. And I, 
I don't know the the result. Yeah. I think the only issue I had with her was packing that rim up. Mm. Yeah, I think that that was too soon. I I totally agree. Like some people, some people do. A year or some years. people never do it. Girl, it's this special. Lavelle Crawford got a special, and he was like, "White people never stop looking for their kids." They'd be like, "Make bird noises if you can't talk." <laughs> She loves birds. Oh my like, god! Like he was like they literally they never stop they looking. Never. Mm-hmm. They're all their life. Like we still talking about John Bonet Ramsey. Like, That's uh, that is the truth. She and dead? she grown. They said she dead, but she, she could be grown. We still talking about her. They still talk about. Her. Oh, they I mean, never she got many specials. It. I don't think so. They many specials. Never, they never find many Jimmy specials. Like little specials. Yeah, because she was small. <laughs> many specials. <laughs> That's not nothing to play about. Okay. All right. Because <laughs> she was small. She was um, small. She was but yeah, so I just now. I feel like and then Who another keeps thing. Saying that she grown in? She it's her. She keeps saying it. Saint Patrick over there. <laughs> Saint <I>, uh, Patrick. <laughs> Saint Patricia. This show is so good, and we have so much to talk about it that we're gonna just stop this here, put a pin in it, and come back. <laughs> <laughs>